Hi friends, welcome back to Mac Warrior 5 and Mercenaries, the rise of Russell Hike. Now, after that last video, hopefully all of your faces are neither scarred nor scared. Let's jump into the next mission. Following the Dragon's Breath's desertion and Irvis and Lieutenant Mirbox's last stand, both the Götterdämmerung Society and the Ronin 211th Mechanized Assault Command have diverted their attention towards each other, no longer perceiving the first tier as the primary threat in the fight over Günzburg. While this has provided us with a limited window to lick our wounds and recover, I'm afraid that the window is now closing fast. I've just received word that the Götterdämmerung Society has landed a huge blow against the Ronin of the 211th Mechanized Assault Command. The Ronin have been pushed out of the territory, they once occupied and have fallen back to the Bavaria Mountains. Ah! Kelsva is now mobilizing the entirety of the Götterdämmerung and the Kelsva guards to move in on the Ronin's position and destroy them for good. After they destroy the Ronin, Kelsva would like to turn to hunt us down next. In our present state, there will be a fight we cannot win. Our best chance of taking Kelsva out is to overwhelm her when she at least expects it. Which will be in the midst of her operation against the Ronin. With our blow to her logistics network, the Luramex and vehicles can only run on the ammo they can physically carry into a fight. If we catch Kelsva and her mercs at the right time, we could use the Ronin as a force multiplier, pushing the Götterdämmerung to bleed their limited ammo bins dry. This will give us the best chance at drawing Kelsva out and killing her, which should send her mercs packing. I won't lie, this op will be an extreme Hail Mary. While millions of things can go sideways, the reality is that this is our last chance at giving the people of Günzburg their freedom. We owe it to Miraborg, our murdered families, and those countless others who've already laid down their lives in the name of freedom to continue this fight. And God willing, we will emerge victorious. I've just had to, to suppress the urge to shout weird things in those last two sentences. <clears throat> Let's go. Destroy all encountered hostile forces. Doesn't matter if they're Cretans or Lurens, so kill everything. Alright. We might have some support, though. Uh, we could get 20 salvage shares, but of course we only get 10 because of rank and whatnot. Mission starts in 15 days. Okay. So, maybe this is the mission where we need to be Atlas. Maybe this is maybe this is Atlas territory now. Um, let's see, when is this? The Zeus is going to be ready, right? A lot of mechs are going to be ready. Um, I'm gonna use the remove the battle master and we're gonna give it to the awesome with the PPCs. So we can Schneeborino. That stalker might be ready, but oh what else could we send? We could set this learn stalker. This looks good, doesn't it? Four learn tens and large lasers? Yeah! Okay, this should be good. This should be good. I'm, I am I have a good feeling about this. Hopefully it won't be bad. Hopefully it won't be bad. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Let's go. We just says bring the victor. I have an atlas. I'm not bringing a victor. Right choice. Has fully ah, the yes. Guto I'm familiar with the Bavaria Mountains. Okay. Ah. The battle ahead will not be easy, but it's a fight we must win. Otherwise, Gunsberg will be lost to the same monsters that murdered our families and nearly killed Oversterleutnant Miraborg. Move out and destroy them all. Destroy them all! Commander, with three separate armies fighting a must-win scenario, this mission will likely devolve into absolute chaos. To get through this, you'll need to stick close and support the first tier mechs accompanying you on this mission. All right. your targets carefully and do not draw too much attention to yourself. Otherwise, you could find yourself simultaneously targeted by both Steiner and Carita of Force. Oh, you mean don't don't aggro the AI too much so they doesn't so the AI doesn't fist fuck you to death? Okay. Uh, what? Ha! 
<laughs> he flew into the wall. What a moron. What a moron. Oh, that Victor's dying slowly here. Oh, this guy's dead though. This is a Luren Griffin, a Kuitan Griffin. Oh, it doesn't matter. Just lure it. I guess it doesn't matter. Just lure it. Oh. Where? Why? How? When? Ah. Okay. Be ready for Nicole when she comes. Be ready for Nicole when she comes. Wait, what? What is, what is this? I have this tantalizing target showing up and then it's hiding again. New target, Warhammer. Warhammer. Different faction, probably. That would be a Cretan mech, right? Um, I'm stuck on shit. Yikes. Goodbye, Vito. It's nice target knowing you. Destroy. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Yeah, change this to chain fire. Okay. I have no idea what I just shot, but um not really getting any info. Oh here we go. Well, it's gone target again. Yeah, that would be that would be a Cretan mech. Right? Let's, let's show him a little bit more heavy fire. Can you please not dance in front of me? So I can finally do this. Thank you. Boom. Oh, hello. We're on it, boss. It's a Crusader. Oops. The Locust. Lock, 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 lock. Banana Joe! Whee! Enemy mech destroyed! Yep. New target, Locust. Alright, Mr. Locust. Target acquired. What are you doing here, dude? Go away. I'm gonna use my go away to make him go away. Yeah, he's going away now. What just hit us, by the way? That Locus is just wasting our ammo right now. Okay, he's not wasting ammo anymore. Oh! It's a catapult. Who is he fighting? Is he fighting anybody? He's just looking at us right now. Nope. So much for the- Hey! Let them fight each other! Let them fight each other! <laughs> You are fudged, dude. I'm detecting Ronin Goodbye. reinforcement entering the OZ. Target destroyed. Scrap that one. Target destroyed. An archer. Target acquired. Do some Lermage on him. New target, Archer. The catapult is still here as well. Well, no, stay with me, guys. Stay with me. New target, hmm. Okay, he should be dead here, actually. He's getting murdered. <laughs> well, she wasn't wrong. The mech was done in no time. Well, hello? Excuse us? On the board. Well, half the weapons just went into the ass of our stalker. And my AC20 just hit the wall. Are you dead, please? Nice. Focus fire on target. She killed that walker. Doesn't she mean battle mech? 
Uh, can you stop that, please? No? Target yes? Destroyed. Good. What the fuck is behind me? Copy. How? Sensor. What are these sensors? Where did we buy them? Toys R Us? Ay, 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 ay. Dropship coming in. I really hope this is not one of those missions where it just zergs you down like crazy. The Crusaders are looking so hot either. Our AI mates, of course, shooting the enemy dropship. That makes no sense, but they're still doing it. <clears throat> banshee. That's a good Banshee, actually. With you. Come back! Oh, hello. Atlas? There's no Atlas. Ow. Can't see shit. Because I'm getting pushed by three mechs at the same time right now. Oh hey, there goes my AC-20. Nice. This is nice. I really like this target focus. This is fun. Oh, there's the Atlas. Okay, I need a different mech now. Nope, not that one. Not that one, I just wasn't that one. That's better. Um... It's funny how the AI follows you around with its aggro. Depending on which mech you join, the AI just follows you. Oh, nice. Okay, he's one shot. And he's dead. Good riddance. I only wish Miraborg and all the other souls we've lost to that bitch were here to see her get what she deserved. The fact that the AI followed me around is just ridiculous. Yeah, I'm gonna punch you to death, you stupid whatever. Face the fist! You like the fisty cuffs? Yeah. Oh hey, there's also a fresh Zeus behind us apparently. All right. What are the last lasers? Yeah. Oh, we already hit critical. Well then, let's do Zeus on Zeus action, I guess. I have the Atlas though. Maybe do some fiddle fisticuffs. It's actually close, this guy is very really fresh. But the Atlas fist from behind is doing wonders for his complexion. Atlas wins again. Rita and Steiner hostiles have been eliminated. Gunsberg is ours. Woohoo! Yay! That was a tough fight. That was a tough fight. But um, that player focus is just ridiculous, PGI. Sorry, that is just unacceptable. It follows you around. 
5 million C bills. Um, the enemy Atlas is of course not available, but I could get the Orion. The K Orion. That was the that was the thing that wrecked my Atlas, by the way. He just like AC10 SM4 medium lasers. He just kept shooting me. He didn't stop. These guys are good weapons, by the way, as well. All oh, these dudes have good good weapons. Do we get any double heat sinks? Nope. No good tech here. Besides from these medium lasers. On that large laser, maybe. Dumb 20 stream, dumb 15. Hmm. And I'm gonna take a crusader on top of that as well. 5.5 million salvage. 3 million lost in repairs. Um. Damage of, of the AI was actually okay. I mean, the highest one got to half my damage, but it was okay-ish. Alright. Stalker. Measly 68k repair. Atlas took 862 damage. <laughs> Hashtag just Atlas things. Yeah. Who, said, who wanted me to go in the victor? I would have been dead a long time ago in the victor. <laughs> ah. For the first time in centuries, Gunsburg is free. This freedom was earned off the backs of tens of thousands that lost their lives fighting to liberate this world. Many call home. We've now learned that Nicole Kelsva did not just purge the families with connections to the first tier, but the entirety of the Valter's governing body approved by elected Prince Magnuson's office. In the absence of any governing body, I've assigned Tor Miraborg to act as Ginsburg's interim Valter. A position I will pension Prince Magnuson to make permanent, as I can think of no better man to lead Ginsburg into the future than the one that devoted most of his life to seeing his homeworld freed. I pray his new position brings Tor some solace, as his mood has darkened since the Dragon's Breath incident. As for us, Commander, what we're now calling the Ronin War still rages on. Although now we can see the light at the end of the tunnel, loyal DCMS forces have been true to the Kanrei Kuritas world and have helped the Kung's army secure worlds that saw Ronin uprisings in the name of the Republic. But the fight is not yet done and I expect us to deploy once more after I update Prince Mackerson on our current status. Until then, start repairs and be prepared to ship out at a moment's notice. We get 5 million sea bills, we get an atlas on top, nice, and uh, some weapons, nice. Now, I think they don't mean pension here, I think they mean petition. To pension, Somebody means to send somebody to dismiss somebody from employment. I will pension Miss Magnuson, me, but Prince Magnuson means I will basically put Miss, Prince Magnuson out of a job and force him into retirement. I think they mean petition here. Aside from some gram grammatical errors here, those, those texts are just. Um, like, the contents are fine and interesting what's going on, but for me personally, all the grammatical errors and, like, weird things going on with the texts really take away some of the immersion. Alright, achievement unlocked, living the dream for whatever reason. Uh, let's see, we can depart again in 28 days. How are we supposed to repair all our mechs in 28 days? We just took a beating. 57 days, 7 days, 33 days, 41 days, alright, I'm gonna sell the Crusader. Um, that Orion actually should be quick to repair, right? 45 days. What about the Atlas? Oof, somebody's cockpit got destroyed. 
Um, let's see. Let's make a good atlas here, even though it's going to take a little bit. 54 days right now just to get this thing going. Remember medium lasers. Four medium lasers. AC-20 burst fire, because we can. And then... LRM-10. Do you have a good LRM-20? LRM-20 stream. Do I have an LRM-10 stream? Not really. Oh well. Two tons of LRM ammo. Adapt the armor. By the way, also last um, mission, if you saw it, we didn't get killed by getting shot in the back. People are always worried about getting shot in the back in MechWarrior 5, and they should be more than MechWarrior Online, but still, like something like 10 back armor should be fine. Um, I wouldn't be too, much, too worried too much about, about getting shot in the back. Maybe a half ton of LRM ammo on top? I don't know. The AC-20 ammo could also use a half ton. Like so, maybe. Okay. That should be a solid mech. Cooling should be fine as well. 100 days! Yeah, something tells me this mech is not going to be ready, unfortunately. <laughs> I guess we'll find out in the next video when we depart for what I think is going to be the last mission of this uh, campaign, of this DLC. So, I'm pumped for that. Let's hope it is a good one. Guys, if you enjoyed this content, if you'd like to support me, check out the join button on YouTube, check out the super thanks button in the comments, or Patreon slash the merch store. All listed in the video description. Have a pleasant day.